Are you struggling with your internet connection? Our full fiber network uses the UK's most reliable broadband technology, but occasionally you may experience a drop in connectivity, which can leave you feeling a little frustrated. So here are four easy steps to try that'll help you stay connected. Step one, check the cables. Check the cables connecting your router and optical network terminal don't have any visible damage. They're not bent, damaged, or squeezed. It is especially important to take extra care with fiber cables as they are made of brittle glass so can be snapped internally. Sharp bends and kinks can mean that the light can't be transmitted, which could cause your internet to stop working. Make sure your ONT is connected to the router port marked with a global logo. You should hear a satisfying click when the cable is plugged in. It's important to ensure everything is connected and all cables are plugged in securely. If you're still having no success, let's try step two. Step two, check the lights on your ONT. There should be three green lights, two solid and one blinking. If any of the lights are red, try restarting the ONT by turning it off at the wall socket and then unplugging the power cable for at least one minute. After that, plug the cable back in and turn everything back on. If the light is still red, contact our support team on 0800 0820770. Step three, check the lights on your router. For Technicolor routers, the power and internet lights should be solid blue. If they are flashing red or the lights are off, check carefully that the Ethernet cable is connected from the ONT into the router port marked with a global logo. If it is, unplug the router power cable at the wall power socket and wait for three minutes. Then plug it back in and wait for two minutes until the solid blue light returns. If the router is still red after two minutes, you may need to do a factory reset. Press and hold the reset button at the back of the router until the power light turns off, then release the button and the router will reconfigure itself. If you are using your own router as opposed to the one supplied by Community Fiber, please contact the manufacturer for support or troubleshooting. Step four, test your internet connection with a few devices. Sometimes the issue can be related to a specific device. So it's important to check all devices in your household as part of the troubleshooting exercise. We hope that these steps have helped you reconnect to the internet. If you need help with anything else, our FAQ section is full of useful information and troubleshooting tips for common issues. Simply visit help.communityfibre.co.uk. Thanks for choosing Community Fibre.